Good afternoon, everyone. It's me, Marnell Moscardo. I'm, here at, I'm a senior here at University of California, Riverside, and majoring in psychology, and I'm finally set to graduate with my Bachelor's of Arts this June 2016. I first got into the NAS program as a junior at Crenshaw High School. At first, I was extremely hesitant to be a part of this, of this venture, mainly because I did not know what they would expect of me and what part it could possibly play in my future. Six years later, I am very happy that I chose to the, commit that I chose to commit to this organization. NASP has always been there to push me and support me throughout all my goals. Each mentor I reached out to was always available and responded quickly every single time I needed a helping hand or an ear for support. A personal story I wanted to share about this program was during my sophomore year at UC Riverside. I got pregnant with my son, Xander, and had to take a quarter off to recover after his birth. I did attend classes two days after returning from the hospital. However, I found it to be extremely strenuous, and I felt that I owed it to myself to take it easy and bond with my newborn son. After withdrawing from the quarter, I found that I owed money to the school to regain student status, and I fell into a time deadline to find $2,500 before fall quarter started. I reached out to many of the previous Crenshaw educators, as well as my family and friends. I tried to get a job, and it did help, but I was still short $2,300 with a month and a half left before fall quarter. I had reached out to one of the NASP mentors, Ms. Tanya Victor, and she agreed to arrange a lunch with Ms. Norris Rice, her husband, Jean Rice, my first mentor, Ms. Madeline Murray, and Mr. Ramsey J. Jr. to figure out if they would be able to help me. And what they did next was something that I still thank God for and this program today. They wrote a check for the entire amount after seeing how dedicated I was about completing my education and wanting a better life for myself and my new son. With that check, I vowed to finish my degree as a token of great appreciation to the program, my son, and the mentors sitting on that table that day. After graduation, I, I would still like to get a master's degree to better my opportunity to find, a better, to find a promising career and a stable life for myself and my new family. NASP has been such an important part of my life growing up. They taught me to realize my self-worth, gain confidence speaking in front of audiences, encouraged me to take risks, and put myself in, uncomfort in uncomfortable situations to face my fears. They have been nothing but supportive, and I promise to reciprocate the support for them. This is a message to the future Crenshaw graduates in the NASP program. Never let go of this great opportunity. Be smart about your decisions and never hesitate to reach out to your mentors or anyone you feel comfortable speaking to during the times of need in college. Guarantee you're gonna have some. It's a very complex journey and it doesn't only require financial support but physical, emotional, and spiritual, spiritual support as well. And they're willing to help you with all of that because you showed them your, that you were worth putting their time and effort into. They're not there to judge you and they see potential in you and believe in you so much they're willing to stand for you and put their reputations on the line. With that being said, thank you so much to the NASP mentors that have dedicated their time. Thank you to the sponsors dedicating their treasure. Thank you to the program for existing and allowing this opportunity for many young scholars. And thank you to Mr. Brown for chasing me down all those Crenshaw high years. Bye.